Hello friends, this is Gaurav and uh, welcome to Parametric Curiosity and I'm doing a video after long back to a speaking video and uh, in this I would be telling you about uh, a script which I did for bending uh, paper or more like folding it uh, through Kangaroo 2 physics engine and Kangaroo 2 is uh, the latest version of Kangaroo and most people prefer to use Kangaroo 2 today because in some time Kangaroo earlier version uh, will become obsolete and also it, it has reduced like a lot of options and it's easier to use Kangaroo 2 okay so let me show you the script like what I'm trying to do it's an interesting one so as you can see like there is a mesh surface which I have generated so first of all we create a mesh uh, for which uh, will be acting as a base surface to fold then after that we extract the information from this mesh uh, through weaver bird components and these uh, extracted informations would be used for the kangaroo forces which will tend to fold this paper uh, through the kangaroo forces so I've used three, uh, used three types of forces that is spring force uh, then the anchor points uh, which will be uh, there and then uh, a hinge force so basically hinge force is the main force which would be um, supporting this folding and then uh, as you can see like kangaroo 2 you put in all the forces together uh, with a flattened uh, command and also the output which you want to see uh, you put it in a show component and then uh, you insert it also into goal objects and then finally we can use a very good component that's called uh, sort by objects by type and then you can extract only the meshes which are there so let us run this uh, simulation and see uh, what are the results and I'm guessing they're very interesting to you and th this is like the reset button and this is right now it stopped the kangaroo 2 so let me make it to true and as you can see like it starts folding and when it says converged that means it's reached the solution which it offers to you and then you can use uh, uh, reset button to again see the simulations and so that's like uh, one of the example so this is uh, with the single surface and the next one which I will show you would be a system of multiple meshes in which uh, we can relax uh, multiple meshes together but uh, this form kind of looks like interesting and uh, you can explore more options uh, to do this.